So I thought I'd make a quick video on what the difference is between a mass airflow sensor and a manifold absolute pressure sensor and what they do. And both of these sensors are very similar in that they affect the air fuel ratio mixture going into the engine. Since the onboard computer is using both of these sensors to adjust the air fuel ratio mixture going into the cylinder so that the engine can run properly. And so the mass sensor is the main sensor that the onboard computer uses to adjust the air fuel ratio mixture going into the engine. And it's located near the air intake box and just measures all the air that's going into the engine. But how dense the air is can change depending on elevation or different factors like this. So if you're at sea level and you go up a big mountain, then the density of the air can change. And so for the onboard computer to know what the density of the air is, it uses the MAP sensor or the manifold absolute pressure sensor to adjust this and to get the correct air fuel ratio mixture going in the engine so that the engine can keep running correctly and the best that it can. And so the MAP sensor is usually going to be located on the intake manifold or be connected to it with the hose. And it helps the onboard computer know what the density of the air is since this can change mainly with altitude. But the MAF sensor is just reporting back to the onboard computer how much all the air going into the engine is. And so while these sensors are very similar, they are doing different things and they both could be important for the engine to keep running properly and running the best that it can. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to make a quick video on what the difference between a MAF sensor and a MAP sensor is. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.